In the U.S., the so-called war on terror has been fought primarily, and largely successfully, by law enforcement and civilian courts. U.S. prisons currently hold more than 460 individuals convicted of crimes related to international or domestic terrorism. Many convicted of material support for terrorism in the years following the 9-11 attacks will start to be released over the next five years, raising questions of how the U.S. will mitigate the risk of recidivism. Most violent criminals are young and tend to age out of violent crime, but supporters of terrorist groups like the Islamic State often don't age out of their motivations and beliefs. Their looming release highlights the need for proactive solutions to recidivism.